Let's talk about dates and Google Spreadsheets. If you're trying to organize a spreadsheet by date of birth or by dates of anything, you're going to run into a problem because by default, um, Google Spreadsheets is actually set to be US based. So you can see here that I've already typed in some dates here. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. But when I hit 23rd of the 7th, 2001, I'm, I'm meaning the 23rd of July, 2001, but because the locale of the Google spreadsheet is the US, it thinks it's just a random text thing. It thinks there's no such month as the 23rd, and the 31st, there's no such month as the 31st. And then when I go back to the 4th of June, 2005, it's, it's saying it's the 6th of the 4th, 2005. So if I'm trying to organize this by date, I want to start with the youngest at the top and the oldest at the bottom. If I just click on this square, it'll highlight all my um, my spreadsheet. If I go to data and sort range, I'm just going to sort by column A, A to Z. And what it does is, yeah, it works with that okay, 2003, 2004, 2005, but this is regarded as just simple text box, basically. Um, so it doesn't organize that. 2000 and 2001 obviously should be at the top. So what you need to do actually before you even start messing around with dates and stuff, you need to change your spreadsheet settings basically in your Google Spreadsheets. So if you go to File and spread, Spreadsheet Settings, you can change from United States to United Kingdom, let's say. There's no Singapore there, but United Kingdom we know has the dates that we want to use. Okay, so if I do 23rd of the 4th, 2003 now, it should move over to the right. It recognizes it's, okay, it's the 23rd of the 4th month. So if I do 21st of the 5th, 2000, 3rd of the 4th, 2005, 5th of the 7th, 2001, and then I'll go back 18th of the 12th, 1999. Okay, so they're right justified now. Google Spreadsheet is saying, okay, you've got dates there. We're in the UK regional settings. I'm happy with that. So again, now I'm going to want, I want to sort them by earliest, youngest student to the oldest student. So I'm going to click on this square again, which highlights everything. Data, sort range. Okay, column A, which is this one. I don't have a header row. If you had a header row that says date, and name, you could choose that, and then this would change to date and name, you just picked whatever one. A to Z will be from earliest to oldest, Z to A would be oldest to youngest. So I'm just going to click sort, and there we go, 1999, 2000, 2001, 2003, 2005. So, if you think you're going to be using Google Spreadsheets to organize dates, um, you're going to have to do that first before you do anything else. And this spreadsheet settings will just carry on to every spreadsheet that you do then. I hope that helps some people.